Hi Virgo, I'm Susie from The Gift 202. I'm here to read your cards for the next 7 to 10 days. It's usually like 10 days. I think weeks are sped up now. Angel, spirit guides. Um, do you know the song I keep hearing? The Eye of the Tiger. Just as I started your reading, um, hearing it, I'm thinking you should go and play it for some reason. It's going to give you a lot of uh, power. Um, angels, spirit guides. What would you like? Virgo to know about this week of the 20th, next 7 to 10 days. Virgo, please. Virgo. Virgo, Virgo, Virgo. Would you like Virgo to know about the next 7 to 10 days? Virgo. Would you like Virgo to know about the next 7 to 10 days? Virgo, please. Virgo to know next 7 to 10 days. Virgo. Virgo, Virgo, Virgo. Okay, Virgo, Nine of Pentacles. You are about to master something that only you can do. Everyone's going to be very jealous of it, and they're going to say, how did you do that? And you're going to say, I worked effing hard for it, and I deserve the mastery. It's independence, and it's travel. Um, we've got the Knight of Wands. You could have uh, getting be getting victory, the Six of Wands, over some kind of addiction or someone who keeps flying in and out of your life who's drinking um it's like people are saying well done for uh having some fun maybe uh or getting rid of someone who's flying in and out there's some kind of healing of the heart going on here um and you're getting your money back up your sovereignty there could be a lump sum of money coming in and this enables you to get out of this third party trap of keeping one person from finding out about another or being very overwhelmed maybe uh, of worrying about money or a family or some kind of security you're taking no prisoners this week virgo you're saying you come correct you speak the truth i'm very knowledgeable i'm cultivable for relationship I'm going, I've been invited away, I'm going to a new um, commitment, I'm going to, on my quest, um, at the moment I've got one foot in and one foot out. This King of Swords, who's a counterpart to the Queen of Swords, is also kind of cold to relationships, but it's legal, there's something to do with um, uh, speaking his truth, being, saying, this is how it's going to go, this is the legal way to do it. Um, lawyer doctor surgeon um he's he wants to come in and balance things up maybe there's a decision to make after a bit of cross swords or a stalemate maybe these two people have this someone might be wanting to go somewhere the other person doesn't um so it causes this stalemate where there's a block there needs to be a decision made I don't know whether someone backs down. I don't know what, what happens, but the sun and the wheel of fortune are your blessings this week. So whatever decisions made, it's like God decides it's time for your fate to turn, for your life to be seen, transformed. There's a total life transformation. It could be a Leo, it could be a new home. It could be travel, joy, health. Um, luck, it's your turn. The wheels are turning in your favour, Virgo. And it's after this truth comes out or this, um, you take your quest seriously and you start to making decisions for yourself. You're out of that eight of, uh, of swords, out of the overwhelm. You've got victory over a vice or over a um, person that's just drinking drugs, rock and roll. And after, after the fun, is you're starting to heal your heart um, by getting out of this trap, by feeling trapped. Maybe it's because you've got this money, it's enabled you to get out so that you can be knowledgeable, that you can go on your quest. This King of Swords wants to tell you the truth and balance things up. It might cause a bit of a, well, I'm not budging, so I'm not budging. But then the sun comes out, healing. You're very, very seen and something very fortunate. It could be towards this mastery that you're going to get. Something happens to make you... I'm hearing the star of the show. 
Virgo, Virgo, Virgo. What would you like Virgo to know about this week and your next card? Let Virgo to know. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. True love. This is the romance of a lifetime. <gasps> Ooh. Is something healing? Is that you're getting back together with somebody, an air sign, angel, spirit guides, Virgo? What's going on with Virgo? This is, and I know there's too many on my lap. What's going on with Virgo? What's the guidance of Virgo in their love life for this week? The 20th of August, the next 7 to 10 days. 20th of August, the next 7 to 10 days. Interesting. The Eye of a Tiger, I heard. Oh, we've got unrequited love. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. Are you coming out of some kind of unrequited love into being seen into something that's better? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? True love. This true love could be a Leo, a tiger, like I said. Angel, spirit guides. Virgo, Virgo, Virgo. Finances and career, financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. So there's something about this inheritance that you're going to get, this money. It's going to overwhelm you and make you feel that you're in a third party situation. But you're going to speak your truth and go and say, I don't want to be in this, should I stay, should I go phase. This King of Swords was also wanted to speak his truth. And this causes a block, a decision to be made. And it's almost like the sun comes in. You win something, you get that job you've always wanted. You get this independence, this money becomes yours. And it changes everything. Angels, spirit guides, finances and career. Okay, I'm the angel, look at this. I'm the angel of abundance. You'll receive the money that you need. And God is in charge of how that will happen. Have faith. God is the sun, the wheel of fortune. It's turning, it's time here. And, and I just picked up that one that was on the bottom of the deck. This, there's something coming for you. I just want to read the book with that sun in. It's illumination. Wow. Okay, there's going to be future joy and happiness despite the current struggle. A sudden stroke of good luck. There's a decision to be made. So it's telling you success is going to come in one direction. Um, that's what I mean. It might, the, something might feel unrequited, but there's something else that trumps it. It could be money. <laughs> Virgo, there's money coming. Have faith. Um, I want to see what that King of Swords wants to tell me. There. Okay, you're going to get a victory over people who have gossiped about you, Virgo, and, and caused destruction. It, it could be something about the finances, and there's something, God is in charge of how your plan is going to work out, but I see that you getting this luck. This is reversed. The three of swords, the, the heart's healing. Could have been after an ending. But there's something else. There's something else. Money's coming. And it's going to prove everything. The person most on Virgo's mind, if they could tell them the truth, what would it be? The person most in your mind. 
I wish I treated you better. You came closer than anyone. The person knows in Virgo's mind. I hope that you can forgive me one day and I'm afraid to contact you. I will wait for a sign from you. They will be regretting it because I think you're going to have some kind of massive glow up in the next seven to ten days. Uh, take care, Virgo, and I will speak to you soon. Bye-bye.